our Sultan has also a lot of love for Mr. Adarokta. Yes, he yes, he's very caring. Yes, he that. calls him the spiritual son. He gave him his, his personal stuff. And when he spoke about uh, Sheikh Adarokta, he was full of love and happiness. Uh, I'm seeing in his videos, mashallah. He's Masha very, very special in, in the eyes of Allah. Alhamdulillah, mashallah. So, what do you think about Mr. Adnan works? About so it's, an, it's, it's amazing, amazing, it's amazing, it's amazing because it's, it's, uh, he has actually gone head on against something that it's very difficult to fight. The Western media, the way they control the media, the way they control the radio, TV, internet, and the, the type of information they can spread through it is amazing. Something that is, that is bad, like cigarettes or fast food or soft drinks, everyone knows it's bad, but the way it's marketed, Everybody's doing it, you see? So to come head on against that sort of media with a concept that is true but not accepted by anyone is very, very hard. And he did that with his relentless efforts continuously until what is hard has become known throughout the world. That's amazing. You need to be so determined, so much faith in Allah to do that because many people simply look at the odds that are stacked against them and say, no, I can't do this. It's impossible. Because the moment you write one article, the hundred articles will come up against you on the internet they say, saying you are wrong, you are misguided, whether from a secular point of view or scientific point of view or Islamic point of view. And Sheikh Adnan Uftah has been, has been targeted by so many different types of people. People from all, from Islam, even from Tariqah. And it's very difficult to stand up against all these people except if you have support. That is why Maulana was saying, or Sultan was saying, that Sheikh Adnan Uftah is not walking alone. Someone is holding his hand, Mashallah. right? Yes. And because of that, he is safe, you know, because he is giving support. Any human being who is given support is able to perform the work of Allah. The Prophet constantly said, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, that I never spoke all my life. Whatever I spoke, Wahyun Yuha. It was a divine gift from Allah. So I am not saying except the words of the Almighty. And Malala himself is saying, I don't speak except what my grand Shay is asking me to say. And the Grand Shaykh will say, I'm not speaking except what my Shaykh is asking me to say. And all the way up to Rasulullah who is saying, I'm not speaking except what Allah is asking me to say. So only one who has support from above can bring something from above to the people. And just like what comes from Allah in the Holy Quran, look at rain that comes down. That single water that comes from the sky is able to suffice for all of mankind, all of the plants, all of the animals. Everyone is happy. right? And that single Quran that comes suffices for everybody. So what comes from the divine is there is a certain power that can penetrate into the hearts of people. That is why many, many scholars speak but cannot bring people to Islam, right? But when you are looking at people like Maulana and Sheikh Adnan Oftar, they are able to speak and bring people to Islam and bring people to realization because they are speaking to the hearts of people. And that can only come if you are getting spiritual support. MashaAllah. MashaAllah. May Allah bless all the good and hard work you are putting into this channel, MashaAllah give you so much uh, blessings because you are working very hard to bring the blessings of Allah to the people. May Allah give uh, you all that you desire in this world inshallah and in the hereafter and give you spiritual support inshallah that despite what happens in the coming times which are going to be very difficult, Maulana says, may there be a, a support in your heart that constantly keeps you contented and happy. Con connected to Allah, connected to Rasulullah, connected to the awliya Allah and may that constantly be a support to all of you, the whole staff, everybody who is working so hard on your channel and may you constantly be guided by Allah so that you are not being pulled away from your, your true destiny and may you eventually reach your private oceans in happiness inshallah. inshallah.